The American Cancer Society is kicking off their annual Making Strides Against Breast Cancer fundraiser with a special breakfast this morning. Roland Rodriguez joins us live from the Lexington. And Roland, I hear you've got a celebrity with you. <laughs> Hi, good morning, guys, and good morning, South Texas. Of course, we have a celebrity, Miss Jen Lara. Who else? But let me first off start off that this breakfast is not open to the public. It's just a kickoff for the big fundraiser. Exactly. And you've been a part of this since day one. I what, have. 10 years ago? Yeah, what we are doing right now, Roland, we're kicking off our 10 year anniversary of making strides against uh, breast cancer here in Corpus Christi. 10 years, I can't believe it. When we first started this here in town, Chris Communications was part of this from day one. And I'll never forget being a part of it all the way back then. It was such a small event, but we were so proud of it. I think we had somewhere around 3,400 participants yeah. that year, and we thought we had made it. We thought it was so amazing to see 3,400 people with us out there that year. And we raised something over $100,000. And keep wow. in mind, this is all money that is used in the fight against breast cancer. Well, fast forward 10 years, and now we're bringing in three times that amount of money, and we've gotten up to close to 20,000 participants who so come out and join us every year to take part in this walk. And it really is something that is just, um, it's really heartwarming, and it's just, it brings such a great sense of community, Roland, and yeah. people know that the reason we do this is because we want to find a cure to breast cancer. Now, of course, that's the biggest thing, because what, one out of eight, eight women are, you exactly. know, are diagnosed with breast cancer, but who does this walk really impact? All right, well, here locally, let me tell you about how the money is used. All that money, all the fundraising that's done here in this community, that money is used locally for different programs that provide support for people who are diagnosed with breast cancer. And keep in mind, we're not just talking about women, we're talking about men as well. So it provides anything rolling from some of these people need rides to get to their doctor's appointments they need um, help with just education they need support where do I go where do I turn to what doctors do I talk to that's the kinds of things that the American Cancer Society is providing through this money additionally some of this money is of course used to continue research because the ultimate goal is to find a cure to breast cancer so that we don't have to have this walk ever again at some point because nobody has it anymore that's the end goal here and that is the ultimate goal of course and this is something we were talking about it's at first it started as a small group of people but now it's a community event where I mean this this is, is a, an event for the whole family. It really is. So if you have never joined us out there before, let me give you some details on the walk. It's October 20th at Bayfront Park, right downtown. It's always held early in the morning, and it's so beautiful out there. We get to see the sunrise, and then we've got all these people decked out in their pink. But while you're there, of course, the uh, between now and the time of the walk, we're fundraising to raise money. The day of the walk, you get out there. We have Zumba. We have live music. We have food trucks. It really become activities for the children. It becomes such a family and community event that you go out there, you spend half your day there, and you just love it. So you do the walk. You come back. There are things to do. You have food together. You have fun together. So I encourage everyone to go out there. We'd love for you to fundraise. We'd love for you to join us on October 20th. You can get details, Roland. It's at makingstrideswalk.org slash Corpus Christi TX. We also have a Facebook page, Making Strides Corpus Christi. So uh, look for that. We're just so excited to, again, Chris Communications be a part of Making Strides Against Breast Cancer Corpus Christi. Yeah, yeah. Jen, thank you so much. And, of course, I know you can be a little bit busy with the breakfast. And, of course, she had me at Zumba and food trucks. <laughs> what else do you want? 